we got to make our deck shadow monsters because apparently she only has light monsters. We're back. We realize what we have to do. Also, we still cannot. We lost to Jinzo number seven. Man, I think if we had enough life points, Obelisk would have died to that widespread ruin, though. Yes, he would have. That would have been the funniest part. But she, like, 100%, you know what? See, this is the one lo ya lost Yom is like, well, now that I've lost to an actual girl, I feel like this is, <laughs> I have to marry her now. I think this is the only way it's going to end. So Yom is like chi chi right now? Yes. Over Ishizu? Yes, if there was a way, <laughs> that, that means that eventually Ishizu would just kind of relent. Because Ishizu was born in like the She'll pyramid. finally allow it at some point. She's like, you know, I don't have a lot of other options on my plate. I have the weird giant underground in the desert. It's either you or the guy who went with my brother. So or Odeon. Oh, it's Odeon. That's actually our rival right now is Odeon. He doesn't know it though because they're just friends and he wants to keep it that way. All right. <laughs> but we're over here like uh <laughs> exactly 100 100% that is us. So here's a question too. If we summon Exodia, do we just win? I don't. Uh, you have to have him yeah. In hand. You don't yes. Him. If all five pieces are in the hand, okay. Yeah. Oh shit! We had Mammoth Graveyard that whole time, and we didn't draw him. What an asshole. Yeah, you know it'd be a good idea to get some more Mammoth more Mammoth Graveyards then. Yeah, definitely. He's really good. At least one more is good. Uh, now that we have that Ritual Monster, at least running two of these dudes is, I think, three of these dudes is pretty good. Yeah. So many monsters to use it. Yeah. Exactly. Curtain. Is that domestic witch cost fourteen because she's a tribute monster? What does that girl suck in her thumb do? She's an effect monster. This one? No, down and then to the left. Nimariku. Sleeping child that is swaddled in an enchanted scarf. It can make all enemy monsters of the field fall asleep. Uh, so she's like uh, a turn to layer. Yeah, it's not bad for like a no that cost. That be pretty good to be honest. When if yeah. she gets out of big field like that again. Definitely. Um, we can probably replace our big dream girl with, uh, the, the witty phantom, but let's see if there's another girl that we could replace him with first. Let's see. Oh, I don't like the brain guy at all. What is this? Oh, it's trap master. Uh, we have a visionary, but, oh, we have ancient sorceress. Oh, but she's not the strongest. It's also a sorcerer. I misread that. Misgendering our Yu-Gi-Oh cards? I'm sorry. I hate to do it. Oh, there's fucking La Jin's buff ass. Uh, <laughs> oh, he cost 260. What the hell? Well, he's an 18. So it makes sense. You know, you have to pay that much if you want Will Smith in your game. Dark Elf would be great, but we cannot handle Dark Elf, right? No, not yeah. close. It's funny that there's the Wretched Ghost, but there's no Karibo. Beast of Gilfer is so good, but he costs so much. I think this might be our girl. Hibakame? Hibakame? Yeah. Alright. Panther Warrior's dark? Yeah. Okay. What's the darkness inside of <laughs> Panther Warrior? <laughs> Panther Warrior has a troubled past. Is that guy 2,000, 2,000? How fucking much does he cost? Uh, 319 for a 2,000, 2,000. They got rid of his shitty effect because he's the guy who's like, for every card in your hand, his attack is less. 500 less. So they removed his shitty effect and they only... Fucking godlike now. Yeah. Also, realize, look, that this guy has 800 defense. Same cost. Huh. Mystical Elf has an effect? The highest cost that they put in or something. Possible. What's her effect? Anyway. Um, I think we're good in terms of dark monsters. I think we have some dark monsters in the deck itself. Oh, we have Sangi. Oh, Sangi is too much. Yeah, he's expensive. You have to pay big bucks for Sangi. What? <laughs> what? What does this guy do? What the fuck? Fuck. Like he's not even that, that good. Be the best card in the game. It might be. It's just more cost than a blue eyes. All right, let's see. Everything let's look. 
cost than a blue eyes. Blue eyes only cost ninety. That's true. All right, let's see who we're getting rid of. So uh, purple monsters have to come out. Like Sangin's got to go. Uh, one moment, because I'm doing it by attack, defense, type. There we go. So what kind of monsters? Uh, fiend. It's the purple color. Oh yeah, so. Like has gotta go. Derek's gotta go. Bye, Derek. Morinfin's gotta go. You lasted this long, buddy. Still love you. Oh, the melting, melting red? red. Yeah. Even you, Etsu. I think that's it. And that's... then we gotta put in uh, more darks. Is our dreams doing us any good here? No, nothing. Okay, so we also need to get rid of her. I think we can find cheap dark monsters in here for a thousand instead of thousand eyes idol. Yeah, there's probably cheap shadows in there. Um, same thing goes for the Genin. We can find a Jonin. Like a Jonin would be too expensive. <laughs> Fair enough. Let's see. We're doing it by attack, defense, Good type, and yeah. then dark. Oh no, one more. There we go. So, yeah, Mammoth Graveyard, another one. Two more. And how much more do we have now? We have 121. Oops, I pressed the wrong button. One moment as I get back to SU. She's cost 172. I can't believe the Dark Magician cost 20. Just to have Dark Magician in the deck. It might be good for Dark Magician Girl. Uh, we do have, we did need a tribute monster, so. Now we have 101. 101, huh? Yeah. Let's see. It's gonna have to be... I think we got Nemomakaru. She's only 59. Yeah. So move the deck. Here's my question of... Um, do we remove one Mammoth Graveyard so we can have her in the deck? No, not oh, her. That's probably a good idea, but we don't Once, need, we just take out one of the Nemurkos and put her in instead. The thing is, it's not going to be enough, right? Because it's fifty; it's only fifty nine. So we won't have oh, enough for she's Witch's one. Okay. No, which is apprentice? We can. I was talking about him, but Kimmy, my bad. Okay, yeah, that's probably a good idea. We'll have enough, right? One one twenty one minus this much. I think so. Try it. So we have one. No, it's not enough. I don't think. Oh, we're over by nine. By nine. I really hope we don't draw them. <laughs> uh, but at that point, can we get rid of Wretched Ghost and add... No, we can't. It's a lot of series of like figuring out what we can and can't use. I think a deck will work fine now. Uh, I hope anyway, because we're about to go challenge our girl once again. Hey, baby. Hey, baby. <laughs> I've improved. I'm back to Zool again. Like a um, little asshole. I completely counter to you. Hello. First, I, she's going to tell us again. <laughs> she's going to tell us the whole thing again. Also, he, I'm pretty sure when we beat her, we get Obelisk. Oh, uh, that'd be great. That will be the ultimate sign of like that she trusts us, right? See, look, at this point, he was, like, ready fully. Then she starts talking, and, like, he's, like, completely lost in her eyes again. You appear surprised. I, what? Uh, 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 yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm, uh, I'm, I'm surprised. I'm surprised. I like that he has the same reaction to her that he had to the reaction of her brother. It's like, wow. If only there was a girl version of Merrick, and then he turns out, there totally is! This works out perfectly for me. Okay, let's see. We're going to have to get another Jinzo number 7 up on this. We only have 5 left. 
Jinzo number seven versus Obelisk. That's good. Yes. All right. Let's see. What uh, is this one? Goddess Light. Yep. So she loses to any dark. Oh, we got our girl Hibikime right off the bat. Yes. So I'm gonna say ah. Uh... Or are you scared of the face down? I am scared of the face down. Then let's uh... use the merc. Okay. We're not gonna use the effect, but it's fine. Damn it. Okay, it's fine. Ended up being okay because we can still win. Yep, it's going to be okay. Oh, yeah. So here's the thing that's 100% like put it on the wall. We can never allow her to draw more than let her have more than three monsters on the field. If she does, then we lose. Yeah, if she gets three monsters, it's just over. Yeah, there is no coming back. Uh, if I use him, oh hell yeah, yeah. So I user effect. There we go. So that means my um my little dude is back to eight hundred. Yep. And and then our our scythe girl. Ah. Oh, Nineteen fifty, all up in there. See you see how I liked how I changed my future. Ah, uh, dream clown. Yes, that was the only card she had that could counter us. Oh, but it's okay because we have other um dudes yeah we have more destruction cards anyway I'm gonna play wood remains yeah yes ass. beat her down to show her how much we care for her yeah we must <laughs> we must prove that we are a man worthy of her you have to shame her in a card game exactly that's how all great relationships start it still would not it would still <laughs> i'll say this right now just to be a dick. oh i don't want to do that to her not to her <laughs> not to her i will play as a serious duelist against her out of respect out of respect with the unhappy maiden oh see look i'm doing like all the nod yom is fighting back against his shitty tactics <laughs> like every time we did but it's only because oh we got the cosmo, cosmo queen that's not obelisk that's not obelisk hmm she said the rule of all the stars and the plants of the cosmos Yes, the rumors are true. You are truly skilled. Thank you. I'm glad that my reputation is known. Perhaps you are one of the one to put put an end to my younger yes. Oh, brother's mad scheme. Oh. oh. Brother scheme. You have a hmm, you have a brother? My younger brother, you already know of him. A man named Eric Ishtar. Please turn your eyes. <laughs> at this point, I'm just staring at her. Yom is staring right at her. Please turn your eyes to the artifact. <laughs> Please look at the artifact. Please, Yom, turn your eyes to the artifact. Do you see the three tablets depicted? They represent the three Egyptian gods of such rarity. They are often dismissed as mirages. Needless to say, their cards are also of great rarity. Anyone obtaining all three of these mystic cards is said to inherit the legend of the eternal invincibility and the title of Dual King. As such, each card embodies a more of strength. Yes, yes, my brother... Has allowed evil to consume his heart. Aw, oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Organize the ghouls to hunt down the rare cards. He hopes to attain the god's cards by doing so. You must stop him no matter what. I'm willing to entrust you with one of the three god cards. Yes! Give me Obelisk. Do it. Before that, oh, you must duel once more. What? Who am oh I god, doing? Do oh, no! <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. So that's it? This is your final test? Oh, duel over a god card? Okay, so this at this point... I'm going to assume Yom is misreading the situation, is seeing this as a whoever wins this gets to duel Ishizu. Whoever wins this, instead of Obelisk, they get Ishizu. Exactly, that's the way he's seeing it at this point. It's like, this is what we're fighting for. 100%. And he also has an anti-Ishizu deck, so I don't know how that's going to work against Kaiba. <laughs> I don't think it will. Kaiba's going to have shit like Vorse Freighter. Oh, he's going to have enemy control. He's going to have a good deck. Oh, no, thank God, he doesn't. But we also have no fucking good cards. He has the Grappler? Okay, so... Okay, back in that bitch. Oh, you know what we can do? We can draw a completely new hand. Yeah, set Dark Hole, and then pot of, play Pot of Greed. I'm also going to set that. Okay. So now we have Acid Trap. No, but then we can keep... And then draw with the yeah with Scale Angel. Angel. Yep. See, we have a lot of card draw, which is good because sometimes our deck just completely fucks us. Oh, if we, 
It's not going to work out. We need a Dark Magician Girl. Fairy Dragon disappears. Okay, we need a good card. Oh, this works out, though. Clone Doron. No, this is good. Yeah. This is good. Play Doron, Clone Doron, and I might not even attack. Because if we get hit by a trap card, then our plan will get fucked up. It's true. Turn end. But then... Okay, okay, good. He didn't have... This is fine. So now sacrifice both of them to the Dark Magician. Oh, this is so good. Yes, yes, keep doing this. Now you have... Both for the Dark Okay, good, then yes. The then summon the Dark Magician. 100%. With Ashizu on the line, I am playing way better than ever before. <laughs> hey, bitch, remember this card? I think you've lost a win before. Fucking PTSD, Kaiba. The dark magician. He suddenly gets extremely angry. All right, so we are now back in that bitch. Yeah, one hundred. We're gonna make him fall for the Griggle Gambit. Yep, uh, absolutely. We are gr Griggle Gambit Seto Kaiba. We are gonna Griggle Gambit motherfucking Seto Kaiba. I also realize that we need to figure out a way to play Mammoth Graveyard. <laughs> what? Clearly, use Griggle to pop that. Yeah, let's start with yeah Griggle attack. Oh, just attack with Dark Magician and win then. It's over. You, Guess who's getting a Shizu? <laughs> well, the ability to date her. <laughs> wow, <laughs> what's up? <laughs> First, I got the girl, then I get the blue eyes, and I get the God card all in one. Jesus, we got we got Obelisk and Blue Eyes Ultimate and a Shizu. All in one game. That's what's up. This is the best duel of my life. Gonna lose to a dreg like you. So careless of me. But even without a god cards, I could win the finals. I don't know, dude. Did you see that fucking card? He dealt 4,000 damage to me. <laughs> also, I think that the, the game is currently messing up, so our great moment of triumph with Ashizu is being <laughs> really <laughs> glitchy. So congratulations, Yom. Hey, thanks. I'll stress you with one of the Egyptian gods. I will return this. Okay, so I'm going to stop your brother. And then we're just going to have a happy life together. I got it. We're going to have a really giant wedding on your brother's funeral. Yes. And if possible, maybe I'll turn him good. And then he can, you know, we can discuss. Okay, we'll discuss this later. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> okay, bye. <laughs> I'll call you. Yeah, the game is horribly messing up right now, so we're going to have to end this for right now. And hopefully the next time we join us. Yeah, I'm going to save, don't worry. It's more that people are just seeing like a blank screen right now, so I don't know at what point they're seeing. Uh, sorry about that, but that's just the way it's going to be as long as I'm currently in my living situation. One day, I hopefully everything will be fixed, but for right now, let's just look forward to the happy pairing that is Yom with Ishizu. Yom, <laughs> as Yom and Ishizu. He finally found the girl after trying so many times to find the perfect girl for him. Atea was ignoring him. Let him on for, years. for years. Insect Queen, it was a mistake. <laughs> the, the, I think we could 100% just say Insect Queen was a mistake on that part. He was scared of Mai, so that never happened. Yeah, Mai was too aggressive. Too aggressive. So now he can finally live happily. With a sh and also Merrick wasn't a girl because he saw Merrick and he thought that maybe there was something there. <laughs> Turns out Merrick was a boy. Yeah, That's Merrick. Why he was surprised when his cheesy said brother. He's like, I think you know what you do look very much like another man I once loved. I mean, <laughs> I mean another person <laughs> that I remember. All right, everyone. See you next time. You know what? I bet I will find good Ashizu art though. For this. <laughs> oh yeah, I'm sure you will.